Yo, what's up everybody? This is Junior Chicken here. Before I present you my top 10 electric type Pokemon countdown, I'd like to do a bit of a Junior Reacts, a bit different than what I usually do because I've started to grow to hate memes. Not that all memes are necessarily bad, there's still some pretty good ones out there if you check my Twitter account, but most of the memes I see now just promote negative traits of society and they just annoy me and sometimes really piss me off and all that, but it makes me like 21 pilots in that I want to turn back time to the good old days of 2012 and mid-2013s when memes were actually good. So I'm scrolling back on my Facebook timeline to 2012 and 2013 to check out some memes I shared from 9gag when memes were actually good. So let's check it out. I'm gonna pop some tags, only got $20 in my pocket. I, I, I'm looking for a cover, look, a dollar. This is fucking us. Ice in the fridge. This is a kid's letter. A kid wrote this. The people like, damn, that's a cold ass donkey. So apparently a girl threw a phone at Macklemore during a concert and he took this probably the best selfie ever. I wear your granddad's clothes. I look incredible. I wear your grandma's clothes. I look incredible. E.T. even likes Macklemore. Walk into the club like, what up? I got a big crock. <laughs> Another one. Walk into the club like, what up? I got a big clock. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Walk into the club like, what up? I got a pit rock. Walk into the club like, what up? I got a big flock. <laughs> And look, Good will even put the lyrics on their billboard for a day. Ah, way your granddad's clothes. No, for real, ask your grandpa, can I have his hand-me-downs? Maybe that's why I stopped following 9gag, because the only good memes were thrift shop ones. Makes an anti-consumerism pop song, gets more airtime than songs about money, cars, and women. This is why I became a fan of Macklemore in the first place. No matter what movie he appears in, I will always call him Harry Potter. And I don't blame you. <laughs> Ten points for Gryffindor. <laughs> the third floor corridor on the right hand side is out of bounds to everyone who does not wish to die a most painful death. Yellow. <laughs> Super Avenger Bros. Oh yeah, look. This is awesome. Samus is Iron Man. Sheik is Black Widow. Kirby is Thor. I feel like Pikachu would most likely suit that. Captain Falcon is Captain America. Link is Hawkeye. And <laughs> Donkey Kong is the Hulk. And apparently Nick Fury is Mario for some reason. The Adventurers assemble. Now this one I really like. This is a pretty good one here. We got Mario as Captain America. Donkey Kong as the Hulk. Think that, I don't know, is that Samus or Princess Peach or whoever is Black Widow. Mega Man is Iron Man. And Link is Thor. Bomberman is Hawkeye. What? So now we got the Mario Avengers. I guess Loki is Bowser. Iron Man is Mario. Black Widow is Daisy. Toad is Captain America. We got... Hawkeye Luigi, the Hulk is Wario, Waluigi is Thor, and I guess that one lady assistant is Princess Peach. Um, but why are Wario, Wario and Waluigi part of the Avengers? They're the bad guys. The angry Avengers. <laughs> oh, peak Avengers. Oh, God. These are the cutest Avengers I've run into so far. <laughs> yes. The Avengers Spongebob edition. Oh my god, this is hilarious. Oh yes. Oh yes. Have you seen Oeyor? He's been missing for days. Thump. <laughs> Edgar Allan Poo. Yes. You see his ears tail on the wall. Uh, more Edgar Allan Poe for you. I'm just a poor boy, nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family. <laughs> Hi, my name is Piglet, and this is Jackass. <laughs> tie them together, Piglet. Can you tie a knot? I cannot. Oh, uh, so you can not. No, I cannot not. Not not. Who's there? Poo. Poo hoo. <laughs> 20 years later. <laughs>
I love it when people compare Winnie the Pooh to Ted. And what do we say to the God of Thunder? Fuck you, Thunder! You can smell. <laughs> now, Ollie with a Super Bowl update. Ollie, it's dark in here! Thanks, Ollie. <laughs> what the fuck? Am I not sure of anything? And you see Zoinberg in the back, he's sad. If the Big Bang Theory stars were in The Simpsons. That's a pretty accurate illustration in my book. I'm the ding dang diddly danger. <laughs> Breaking Ned, yes. <laughs> this is beautiful, <laughs> this is beautiful. The original Angry Bird. Alfred Hitchcock's Angry Birds. It's a bad day to wear green. And if any of you are wondering about the origins of the pigs from the Angry Birds games, I think this might explain it. I see what you did there. Not drunk, just finals week. That's, that's the university that I go to. That is the north residence of the university that I go to. Search hours for a mistake. Missing a fucking semicolon. I used to be a beginner programmer myself, so I dealt with this shit quite a bit. And if you want some bootleg transformer toys... <laughs> I know how people be wanting a dislike button on Facebook, but this... This is what I need. The only time Canadians get violent. <laughs> Getting real tired of your shit spring. Uh... <laughs> We got a badass over here, pouring Pepsi in a Coca-Cola glass. Frying Nemo, oh my god. And it's a Chinese advertisement too, oh god. Oh no. No, no, now I'm depressed, now, this, this, this is actually sad stuff right here. Who hated Waldo so much they had to kill him? There's an uneven number of students in the class. Let's work in couples. The most awkward kid is left alone. Story of my life right there. Go to the job interview. Where do you see yourself in five years? As your boss! Didn't Old Spice just make a commercial about this? I don't need a job because I have swag. Spare change. You have swag? You start tomorrow. Oh good. They accept Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper is my favorite drink, for those who know me very well. Let me walk into McDonald's the other day. Hi, sir, what would you like to have? A McChicken upsized meal, please. What kind of meat would you like on the McChicken, sir? Uh, I don't know, beef? Terribly sorry, sir, we only have chicken meat to work with. <laughs> you fucking... I used to work at McDonald's, so... My teacher can be a huge bit sometime. Okay, class. Who can tell me the answer to this problem? It's 31. Did you use a calculator? No. Then it's wrong. How about someone with a calculator? It's 31. That's right, good job. <laughs> Why did it matter the first guy got it right anyways? Mom arrives. Derp? Yes, Mom? Are you home? <laughs> no! <laughs> Son, buy me a soft drink. Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Diet or regular? Regular. Bottle or can? Bottle. A liter or liter? Damn it, just buy me water. Natural or mineral? Mineral! Cold or hot? I'm gonna strike you with a broom. Stick broom or soft broom? You animal coward pig. Get the fucking out of here. Now or tomorrow? No! Are you going to accompany me or not? I'm going to kill you. Stab me with a knife or shoot you with a gun? Shoot you with a gun in the head or in the stomach. You best cockroach a rat. <laughs> That's when you know you're not ready for kids and they're too much of a smart ass on you. That awkward moment when you realize you're horny and you're on your period. Why no? Bitch, please. True sailors ain't afraid of the Red Sea. <laughs> True tractors dig in the mud. True knight has blood on his sword. Every ketchup needs some mayonnaise. <laughs> I love how Ron McDonald threw that in at the end. <laughs> Prepare for trouble, make it- No! No! 
This stops right now. Ten years. Ten fucking years you've been following me. And guess what? Pikachu, you want him so badly. Here, take him. He's not even shiny. <laughs> I've got like eight more. Because you see, I haven't been wasting my life stalking some kid. I caught my own Pokemon. I've got so many Pokemons, you don't even know what to do with them. I'm fucking tripping balls. Ask Oh, Bitch be tripping balls. Stay the hell out of my sight. Meow, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> A normal team Pokemon land. What are you doing? Roasting marshmallows? I got a friend. You cannot use a fire type like fire. Why? It is degrading. What will you do about it? Aw, oh, Pikachu's getting all smart ass. The Charmander walks away, brings over his laptop, and plugs the charger right in Pikachu's ass. Give Pikachu a taste of his own medicine. Psyd... Psyduck. <laughs> Yeah, Missy's bent over like in the music video and he's side ducks going crazy. This is what happens when you have too much free time in SolidWorks. Yeah, look at that. That's legitimate magnus a legitimate magneton they just made. Damn, mad props for that. The Super Mario Bravas. <laughs> yeah, they're looking G as if. I'm done being second best. Yeah, Luigi went from 0 to 100 real quick. How I met your plumber. <laughs> Luigi is Barney since Stinson. He's got the super bro code, so. Now this is some top tier cosplay right here. Scorpion and Kitana. Two of my favorite Mortal Kombat characters. Dang, Kitana looks sassy. Hey, Apple! Apple! Hey! Hey, Apple! <laughs> I don't always smoke weed, but when I do, I get too damn high. <laughs> Did you guys know, uh, your dick goes in a box. It's my stick in a box. <laughs> goes through your phone to get your friend's number for a surprise party. Now this is actually the reverse of the overly attached girlfriend. This is the same girl, but it's a different kind of meme, so. Randomly shows up at your work to bring you lunch. Follows you home to return the wallet you lost. Who are you texting? Ask them if they want to come join us. Calls and texts you all night, just trying to help you find your phone. Ah, uh, yeah. Follows you to work. You forgot your lunch. Ah, That is girlfriend goals right there. It says crazy overly attached things to you because she fucking cares about you, you dick. Tiny Hippo had a tiny train. He loved that train and they went anywhere together, laughing and playing all throughout their tiny world. Then one day, Tiny Raven swooped down and stole the tiny train. This made the tiny hippo very sad because he decided that he would be brave. So the next day he walked up the tiny mountain and crossed through the tiny valley, climbed up one tiny oak tree, and shaked tiny raven's tiny little bitch ass. And no one fucks with tiny hippo. Ain't no one. <laughs> that escalated quickly. Go to Queen's Inn Hilltop Dental just to remind you they are less painful than an episode of Jersey Shore. Jersey Shore <gasps> is cancelled. <laughs> yeah! Booyah! You can tell that the human race is going downhill when Neil Armstrong dies the same day Snooki has a son. This isn't an equal trade universe. Unless 20 years from now Snooki's son becomes the first man to set foot on Mars. Snooki doesn't know what Mars is. Oh god. The moment you realize Adele is younger than Carly Rae Jepsen. Oh my god. It is still hard to believe. Shh. Did you hear that? I think it's Katy Perry crying in the toilet. Oh my god. That is savage right there. Honey, this is the part when you interrupt me. <laughs> <laughs> e man, you said 
And the funny thing was, they both collaborated with each other in E.T. Marshall is just a simple man caught in a web of fashion he doesn't understand. And here's a good art piece right here. It's an image of Eminem made from M&Ms. Still a better rapper. Still a better rapper than Nicki Minaj. Can you spot the differences between these two photos? Oh my. What if I told you, you can correct people without being an asshole? True. If we are told not to talk to strangers, how do we make friends? I actually like the posts about Canadians being nice. Makes me proud to be a Canadian. Same here. I actually prefer girls who have a little bit of meat on them. And here comes some more real talk. If you can't afford condoms, you can't afford a kid. Now this is some advice that I feel like a lot of people today could use. If you want people to like you, keep your religious and political views to yourself. There are good Christians and evil Christians, and good Muslims and bad Muslims. Alternatively, there are ethical people who live without religion, and evil people who live without religion. Religion does not always correlate with ethics. Get over it. Now here are some words that I live by on a day-to-day -day basis. Be who you are and say what you feel because those who mind don't matter and those who matter don't mind. So those are all the quality throwback memes I could find that I've shared from 2012 and 2013. Hope you enjoyed them. My next video is definitely going to be the top 10 electric type Pokemon countdown. It should be up uh, about a week or less from now. But also, stick around and subscribe because on March 1st, it will be a full 10 years since I've started on YouTube. So there's going to be a special reflection video based on that. So hope you're looking forward to that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.